this is Afraid of the Dark. When I was a little kid, I was afraid of the dark. I dreaded bedtime every night, and when finally forced to turn off the lights, it took me two steps to get from the light switch to the bed. I used to make my mom kneel beside the bed and pray with me. My hands clasped together tight, trying to hold what little bit of light might be left floating around in my room. And after a delayed amen, she'd tell me, go to sleep. You got school in the morning. But I couldn't sleep. And even now, as a senior in high school, I'll go home wishing my mom could kneel beside that bed and pray with me. Because in a few more nights, I'll be walking across the stage having a diploma and responsibility dropped into my hands like a pillow. Too hard to sleep on. Tonight, I'll question closing and opening my eyes because either way I'd see the same thing. And either way I'd have a bad dream. When I was younger, the items in my room would mutate in the grasp of night. My teddy bears turn to clown faces, ceiling fans to sharp swords, and now those same teddy bears turn into college mascots. Ceiling fans spinning, showing how quickly this year will go by. My TV screen, a giant display of the GPA it takes to get into the University of Florida. When I was younger, I jumped from bad dreams in a cold sweat, clutching my blanket like a safety net, sprinting to my mother's room with legs like Bambi and goosebumps riding down my back. I say, Mom. I had a bad dream, and I was with all of my friends, and a monster took them away. Mom, I'm scared. Can I sleep in your bed? And even now, as a senior in high school, I'll go home and have a bad dream, where a monster as high as the SAT scores it takes to get into FSU, arms as wide as the distance I'll be from my family, teeth as sharp as a goodbye to all the people I love, as we go our separate ways. I'm not afraid of the monster. I'm afraid I can't defeat the monster. They expect us to be kings of the classroom when we still have to raise our hands to go to the bathroom. They expect us to assign a career to the rest of our lives when we still get assigned seating during class time. But in early May, they'll expect us to drop our blankies when this whole time we've been being treated like babies. But there is no pacifier to silence the roar of adulthood. No nursery rhyme to rock a by The mountains will have to climb. The training wheels are about to come off. And I'm not sure of the difference between falling and failing, but mom, I'm afraid. Mom, I'm scared. Mom, I'm afraid of the dark. And tonight, instead of kneeling beside the bed and praying with me, or telling me how important it is to go to sleep for school in the morning, please show me how to make the darkness afraid of the